Hey, what's going on guys, it's Bagas here, and today, uh, welcome to another, uh, quiz video. I know, I know, I know. It's not exactly the most creative video idea, but, like, cut me some slack. Coming up with video ideas isn't as easy as you would think. Especially ones that, like, I can just do on a whim. So, yeah, cut me some slack. But anyways, um, so we're doing a dinosaur trivia quiz. That's basically it, really. Um, but I did make sure because actually, the, I'll, I'll show it to you later. But the quiz I specifically picked is it's definitely more interesting. It's more like actual in-depth trivia thing. Yeah, whatever I just said. That. But um, yeah. Hopefully, uh, the audio will work just fine. I have PTSD from um the last recording session I did. Um. So yeah, let's hope nothing goes wrong with the audio. And uh, let's just let's just get into it. All right, here we are in the dinosaur uh, trivia quiz thing, and uh, I'll leave a link in the description if you guys want to uh, test that for yourself. But as you can see, uh, from just these couple of questions, um, yeah, it's definitely it's definitely more uh, interesting, definitely more interesting. But um, yeah, I guess let's just get on with that. You know, the more I think about it, these Sunday videos are taking a chore on me because, like, I won't, uh, well, I won't say too much, but I have, like, several video projects going on, so ha I was having a Sunday video on top of it is just adding, like, the cherry on top of the cake, really. But hey, I gotta keep the consistent uploading schedule, so, yeah. And of my excuses, let's just get on with it. So, uh, first question, it's obviously Velociraptor. No doubt about that. Um, oh, there's a, there's a ding 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 audio. Interesting. Uh, what dinosaur fossil was originally mistaken for a type of bison? Ooh, now this I have no idea. Um, I think it might have something to do with... See, it's all, I, I'm pretty sure it's gonna be between Triceratops and Stegosaurus. I don't think Buffalosaurus is a thing. I, I don't think Buffalosaurus is a thing. Um, it has something, probably something to do with the fact that bison have like enlarged uh, vertebrae on, near the shoulder area, which is uh, a site of large uh, shoulder muscles. I'm pretty sure I got that right. So. Uh, yeah, that or so much, but like bison swords are very small compared to triceratops, so I don't know. If it's buffalo swords, I swear to God, I'm gonna answer stegosaurus. It's not. Is buffalo swords actually a thing? No. So it's triceratops. Okay, okay, well, at least we cleared up the buffalo source that's kind of thing. Um, what is this? Mistakenly identified. Huh, I would have thought that, like, the horns would be distinctive enough from bison. Hmm. Oh, oh, maybe it's, I don't know, I don't know. Hmm. It is interesting. Interesting. Um, well, that, well, okay, well, for this third question... There isn't technically a correct answer since the correct answer is 66, but we'll go with 65 because, although technically speaking, um, this they should be non-avian dinosaurs because technically dinosaurs are still around today, um, in the form of birds. But we're just gonna say 65, and I swear to God, if this is a trick question, I'll, yeah, good. <laughs> um, what is the direct ancestor of? Dinosaurs. Now, when I saw this, I was expecting like a uh, Euparkaria, um, but that that but that third answer does not say Euparkaria. So I'm gonna say I think the closest one would probably be Archosaurus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Makes sense. Makes sense. Uh, what is the lifespan of a T-Rex? I doubt it's that long. I highly doubt it's like a crocodile or a turtle even. Mm. It's between. I mean, th think about it like this: larger animals tend to have longer lifespans, 
So it's either between 50 and 62 or this. I'm gonna go with the... Should I go with the higher SMS first or the lower SMS first? No, I'm gonna go with that. So, yeah, yeah. Yes, yeah, see? Yeah. Yeah. I did think 50 to 60 was a bit of a stretch, but hey. Um... Uh, it's in... Now here's the thing, it's in the Gulf of Mexico. Which I'm assuming is correct, but at the same time, I always get confused with this. Okay, okay, it is, okay, yeah, okay, it is in the Gulf of Mexico. Um, the Gulf of Mexico is in Mexico, yes. Dumb brain, that makes sense. Um, I, okay, now this is a pretty obvious one. This one is a Patasaurus. Um, which of the following has a giraffe like neck? Well, Brachiosaurus, obviously. Um, oh, they did actually mention it here. What is the only dinosaur lineage of five men? Birds. Yeah. Ah, oh, so they do mention it here. It is interesting how they did how they mentioned that, but didn't mention the uh, the non-avian dinosaur specifically there. It is interesting. Ooh, now this I have no idea about. Um. Fifteen horns. I have no idea. Like, my guess is that it's between Cyracosaurus or Cosmoceratops. But I don't know what Cosmoceratops looks like, and I think I know what Cyracosaurus looks like, so I'm just gonna go with Cyracosaurus. No. So it's Cosmos Cosmoceratops. Okay. So my initial guess was correct. Um, but I doubt myself. So, um, this one next. This is gonna be a very boring video, I know, but sh shut up. <laughs> I, I just need a video up. Uh, let's get on with the next one. Which of these dinosaurs have the smallest brain for its body size? I'm assuming Stegosaurus. Stegosaurus, there we go. Uh, what fossil hunter terrorized the bills are... Oh, now this is stuff I have no idea about. Um... But I feel like, um, I don't think it was Mary Anning, I think, maybe it was. See, I don't know, like, the paleontologist specific, uh, trivia. Um. No. No. Maybe it is. If it's Mary Anning, I swear. Oh my god, it is Mary Anning. It is Mary Anning. <laughs> I should have gone with the obvious one. Because, like, Mary Anning is the only one I know. Um, which of the following dogs was which is this? Um, over after? Because, technically speaking, Comstock is obviously have teeth. And, like, these two are so far, so if one of them didn't have teeth, the other one should also not have teeth. So, I mean, either way, I mean, over after is the obvious stress. Hear about your noise, it's the ice cream machine man thing. Um, <laughs> uh, to aid in digestion. I know that one. What was the first mounted dinosaur skeleton? Okay, so since Megalosaurus is not on here, I assume it must be a. Gu I mean, it's either Iguanodon or T Rex. I'm leaning more towards Iguanodon because Iguanodon was found first. So, no, it is T Rex. Wait, what? Is that T-Rex? It's Hadrosaurus. Huh. I didn't know that. Of the small... Oh, I have no idea. I doubt it was 10 inches. Nemicolopterus. I'm, I, I am le I'm actually learning some interesting things. Um, is it named after a commercial airline? None of these names sound legit. <laughs> but I'm... I have no idea. I'm gonna... Nope. 
This is just me guessing, checking, basically. I'm not. I, I can't even call myself that. Um. Oh, this is this is a fun one. It's a um. It's it's pretty much a wide known fact at this point. Uh, let's go up to seven. Seven. Did Utah Raptor grow to seven meters? I don't. Really? I didn't know Utah Raptor was that big. Um. What was it? Okay. Well, this one is Megasaurus. Yep. That's why it's called the Giant Lizard. Uh, well, the giant, um, yeah, 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 giant lizard, what am I talking about? Um, covered, I'm guessing this is Ankylosaurus. I'm guessing it's Ankylosaurus. It should be Ankylosaurus. No, it's not. Well, I know this means three-horned face. And this means, uh, double two things, so it's like a source thing. Ah, okay. Yeah. Um, what dinosaurs believe to work? Well, I'm gonna go with the bet with the biggest. Yep. Um, how long would the average arms of T Rex? I'm guessing like a half a meter. No, so it's a meter. Okay. Huh, that's actually pretty big. Um, well, that's false. Um, when did dinosaurs first appear? The Triassic, of course. Um, three quad. Ooh, which pity what is it? Well, this is the only guy I know. Oh, it's not Robert Baker, okay. Robert Bacher, whatever. Um, no. Wow. I don't know my dinosaur trivia. Well, uh, I ha I have no idea. Is it like hundred pounds? Nope. Five hundred. <laughs> okay, here we go. Okay. I I I I I I don't know at this point. <laughs> um, Dromaeosaurus. I've never heard. It's either raptors or pterodactyls. Okay, okay. Okay, yeah. Because, yeah. like, I, I'm pretty sure I have not heard Triceratops, T Rex, or pterodactyls. Pterodactyls is probably the most, the closest thing. But, like, also, I mean, raptors also refer to, like, it's also, a, like, I don't know what I'm trying to say here. I have very low energy today. Um, raptors is, uh, is also the name for modern, like, Birds of prey, so yeah. A uh, terrible lizard. I know this for sure. Um, so we have like what? Um, oops. Well, that's not the one. So we have like sixty questions. All right. It's because like I'm in a I'm in a test. Hmm. Funny. Um. Ooh, I think this is Sue. It has to be Sue, because I think whatever the male, well, the the quote unquote male T Rex, because it has the male name. Um, this is the second one, but yeah, it's Sue. One, one super common. Yep. Uh, which extinction? Cretaceous Paleogene. Which continents are fossils? Dinosaurs found. All seven. Because you have Carlophosaurus in Antarctica and stuff. Ooh, is is the official? S no, wait. Is Allosaurus the official s state fossil of Colorado? Or is it like Utah? I know Allosaurus is a state fossil of one of the thing, but I don't know which. Okay, so it's Triceratops. Oh, it's a stick source. Huh. Interesting. Yeah. Interesting. I think Alice, I, I know Allosaurus is a state fossil of one of the things, so yeah. Um. 
Well, if I remember my knowledge from when I was thrown in America, I think it's a wishbone. No! Oh, it's all of these. Duh. <laughs> Duh. But hey, I was right. I did retain some knowledge from my Dice documentary watches. Uh, how about the two quiz? Ooh, hip bones. I remember this from the other quiz. Yeah. I remember this from the other quiz. We did. Um, what was the first non carnival star part for? To discover? Um, well, obviously, it's Sarah's in a source, because, well, the other ones are not even. are all carnivores, are carnivores so. Yeah. I have no idea. Okay. Uh, okay. Interesting. I have no idea. I'm. Yep. I <laughs> didn't think so. Uh. Uh. I have no idea who these people are. Also in France, huh? That's interesting. France is like a freaking gold mine. Of dinosaur fossils. How many fossils are necessary? I mean, technically, this is a pretty, um, I'm a, I mean, here's the thing, Troodon was named after a fragmentary teeth, so I don't know, I'm gonna say two, it's one, yep, yep, yep. um, yeah, I mean, I mean, to be fair, it really does depend on like what fragmentary fossils are found because like if you found something that's like very distinctive then yeah that'll be named a new species but if you like found a piece that is a very distinctive then like you have to wait for more fragmentary fossils or even a more complete fossil um china because this is guanlong um how many wings four uh which i'm fine I think comps of Nathus is false. Yeah. Uh, when was the first megasaurus discovered? I think it was the mistake to be a whale. Or was that Mosasaurus? Um. Well, I know it wasn't Rhino. Wait, no, it must. I think it might be human giants actually. Yeah, I remember that. I, <laughs> I remember that from um from Dinosaur Britain. I remember that, yeah, cause I think, yeah, cause I think the whale mistaken identity one was, uh, the first Mosasaurus specimen, uh, yeah, so there's copy of the age of what, I'm guessing Patasaurus, no, Diplodocus, uh, yeah, yeah, uh, uh, which dinosaurs come to the video? Um, I'm guessing this, no. I have no idea. The only ones I know is, I don't even remember the name of it. It's the one from when I was from America. It's the, uh, it's the thing that the Centaurus hunted. I forgot what it's called. <laughs> I forgot what it's called. Um, I, oh, um, I didn't watch this, so I have no idea. I'm gonna say Grumpy. Okay, yeah, just Grumpy. Uh, I have no idea of this either. Okay, okay, I okay, I, I know Jabberwocky from Dragon Ball Z Bridge. I I don't know, I didn't watch this. I didn't watch this at all. Um Thagamizer. Yeah. Four to ten, wow, that's a that's a, that's a lot of Thagamizers right there. Um or is Thagamizer like them as a group, I don't know. Hopping foot. Um. Well, I know it's not you, and I know it's not you. It's... 
Because like this would have thief in it and this would have tyrant. So it's either this or this. Yeah, okay, yeah, okay, yeah. Mm. Uh, cryo, because it's really the ones uh, that I know. Um, wow, um, I have no idea. I don't, I didn't even know this was a thing. Um, yeah, Nicholas Cage does seem like the type of guy who would do this. Um, oh, is it, oh, it's this story. Oh. Why isn't it, why is it Tyrannosaurus, but not Tarbosaurus? I thought, it's from Mongolia. Shouldn't it be Tarbosaurus? Unless, our, unless it wasn't named that then. Oh, but, oh, yeah, it's this story. Ah, I, I, I remember reading, I remember, uh, watching a video about this. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. Hmm. But, yeah, I just based it off because Nicholas Cage just seemed like the type of guy. So, <laughs> um, what's the first Solora source? Well, this name seems African. There you go. This name seems African. And now this, I have no idea. I'm gonna say 400. 800? I swear to god. Okay. Okay. Um. I think it's a trunk. Yeah. <laughs> a trunk. That would have been a very interesting look. Um. Two crested lizard. Because die always means two. So, yeah. Uh, what does a genius name from a single feather? Archaeopteryx. Yeah, Archaeopteryx. I mean, it's the first bird, so I guess it makes sense. Uh, what did Ankyna club? Not a second brain. Um, Deinonychus. Velociraptor, obviously. Why did it take me so long to realize that? So, um, that's... That's the dinosaur quiz. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, um, actually, I, I doubt you even enjoyed the video. So it's just me doing a quiz. So um, yeah. Next video will be a review. So um, yeah. Hope you guys um, yeah, yeah. Since it's hard went to my brain, I might as well just say. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please leave a like, subscribe. Probably didn't, but um, I'll see you guys in the next video. Regardless, uh, yeah. Bye.